the JAMA Network. We've met many patients like you whose tumors are hidden. Ronald Briscoe is talking with doctors about his prostate cancer. My older brother, my father had it, and also my baby brother has it. Doctors found his high-risk prostate cancer by using MRI-guided technology. MRI can tell us where tumors are hiding in the prostate that's not normally sampled. This approach is different from a standard prostate biopsy that uses ultrasound. Ultrasound ensures that the needles hit the prostate but we don't use the ultrasound to direct the needles into where the tumor may be present. We randomly try to get all the prostate sample in, in hopes of catching the cancer. Doctors Peter Pinto and Manaj Siddiqui from the National Cancer Institute, National Institutes of Health, along with their co-authors, looked at more than 1,000 men with elevated PSA levels. These men underwent both an MRI-guided targeted biopsy and also the traditional standard biopsy using ultrasound alone. The results of both biopsies were then compared. The targeted MR-guided biopsy had a 30% increase in detection of high-risk prostate cancer as compared to the traditional biopsies performed today. The study appears in JAMA, Journal of the American Medical Association. Low-risk cancers that are felt to be overdiagnosed and overtreated were actually detected 70% less in the targeted biopsy. While the results of this study are still preliminary, additional research is still needed to understand how this new technology might be used in the future. The benefit of doing that is that we maximize our ability to detect the high-risk cancers that matter and also potentially avoid the harm of detecting cancer which is clinically insignificant and unlikely to cause problems for the patient. If you catch it early and get it done, taken care of, you get to, get to live a longer life. Catherine Dolph, The JAMA Report.